Do you want to do big burst damage like this? Stick around in the video and I'll show you how. So the ranger is let's start let's start with the rotation. The rotation is going to be based kind of on your talent points, which I'll show that later. But your main rotation, your main ability, I guess, for big damage is going to be your rapid shot with Ranger. It's going to be your most OP damage that you're going to get out of the Ranger. 20 second cooldown. Your number two and your number one, decent. Fired around insta shot with number two when it's available. That's basically what you're going to be doing. That's your rotation. Simple enough. But that's what it's going to be all about. You can use your four to buff your three. And I also have a talent where using two steady shots will increase your um, crit damage. So we're going to double one into four into three. So let's start off by going into your talents here. I pick up three into Steady Burst. Casting Steady Shot two times in a row will increase your crit rate and crit damage by 3% for 10 seconds. So we have this stacked with this. Crit damage is increased by 2% when Rapid Strike deals crit damage. So these two together double into one. Our crit damage is now boosted, so now we can pop a three. Whether if we would just... Let me wait for the... Whether if we would just normally pop our three. The biggest damage that's going to come from the ranger with your inscribed stone is going to be resetting your steady shot or your rapid shot excuse me so when we use our stone we're able to reset our rapid shot by firing two steady shots basically your simple rotation is always going to be four to boost your damage into three that's going to be that's going to be it. You can double one to kind double one to lead it so you get extra damage, then your four and then your three. Huge damage. You also want to make sure you're in place at all times with this class. We lose this uh steady bar basically, but we have it talented where our four instantly gives us our full steady. By, by having this on, it allows us to shoot more arrows. If I take all this off and use my three, see how we only shoot four times? But if we have four on with our full boost, it was it's gonna shoot eight times. So your big burst is gonna be something like this. You're gonna go six, into four, into seven, into three, into one twice, and then back to three. So we got six, four, seven, three, double one, reset our three, and then we can use rapid shot again. And then we can kind of fill it in with ones and fives afterwards to kind of do a good filler. But that's gonna be your main burst with this class with seven. But your main little burst is always going to be 4 into 3. That's going to be your main, main way to burst with this class. The talent tree set up in this class that I have is 3 into steady burst. This is going to be for when I'm casting our steady shot twice in a row. It's going to increase our crit rate and crit damage by 3% for 10 seconds. We're also going to take the Rapid Strike, deals 30% more base damage. Because obviously we want our Rapid Strike to be doing major 
major damage. I also took the crit rate up just to help us crit more. Steady shot by 27% damage also increases our stability. Landing a sniper shot makes your next steady shot deal more damage. So landing our two is going to make our one deal 75% more. Corrosion has 100% to keep your stability max. So this also means while moving. See how I move and it instantly goes away right here? If I have four on the target, we have a little bit of time to sit here and move. And still be able to utilize our full percentage of this. We also take two into armor piercing arrow. More than rapid shot makes your targets take 2% more damage from you for three seconds. This can stack up to eight times. Of course, we want anything that buffs our rapid strike. This is our biggest DPS. I also take 45% more damage. Targets below 25% HP. This is going to help you a ton in raids and big bosses. Sniper shot deals 15% more damage and 15% more crit damage. As you remember, sniper shot's also getting boosted when we double steady shot. So this attack's going to be doing a lot, a lot of damage. We also take high zoom lens. Stability of all your damage dealt. We just want more damage. This is going to be more damage for us when we're at max stability. It's going to give us almost 5% more damage. And we're also going to take two into steady fire, which is also going to increase our crit damage by 3%. Also, when rapid strike deals a critical hit, which is our big damage, there's a 100% chance to reduce the cooldown of our corrosive arrow. So we're getting our arrow back 100%. Oh, no, no, no. Cut that out because we don't, we don't have that. Uh, we don't have this to the next level yet. So it's only this one right here has a 66% chance to reduce our uh... the ultimates kind of differ depends on if you're doing PvP or raid depends on if you need like a silence for the boss a knockback or like a AoE trap kind of type thing for your inscribed stones what I like to do is I like to branch off both directions so I can pick up th these uh, emblems. So I can slap on two emblems ASAP. ASAP. We got Sprawl leveled up and we got Burst leveled up. I'm not so sure about Sprawl yet. I'm unsure. So we're still kind of in the testing phase. But while we're on this, talking about emblems. As you can see, this node is boosted by 50%. And this is going to be the best way to mid-max and increase your inscribed stones in this game. If I hover over this this uh, emblem, the additional effects that it's providing, upper right nodes attribute plus 50%. This is best. This is best in slot. You want this effect every single time. You can get this to roll two more times. You could have it boosting the upper, the middle, and the bottom, or vice versa. So you want to look for emblems with all three of these node increases by 15%. That's going to be your best in slot emblems. And of course we feed off a crit, so I just like to boost my crit. I took a bunch of crit, and I took a bunch of like main stat omni and different things like that. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Hit that like button for me. I appreciate it. I appreciate each and every one of you for subscribing. And I'm going to end the video with a little bit of a PvP arena clip with me bursting down these guys for the W. Have a nice day, guys.